I still can't believe you talked me into this. <laughs> Come on, honey. You're gonna throw him off. Uh, it's okay. I'm almost done. A little more light on your hips. God. Why couldn't you have come up with this before I had two kids? <laughs> you look amazing. Okay, I think... Yeah, I'm done. Wanna to come take a look? <laughs> I can't. <laughs> <laughs> you first. No, we'll look together. I don't understand. I, I thought... What the hell is that? Honey, it's okay. This is not what we discussed or what I paid for. I don't understand. I think this is one of the best I've ever done. I want my money back. I'm sorry, but this is not some department store photo studio. And this is not my wife. Yes, it is. You asked me to paint her exactly as she looks. It's exactly what I did. Honey! Oh, stop it! What's going on? Brandon! That check better be in my mailbox by Friday or I'll be back. Come on. What happened? I don't know. They saw the painting and they just freaked out. Brandon, what is this? What do you mean? It's her portrait. What's wrong with it? There's no distorted perspective in any of his other recent works. Not much talent, either. So the symptom just came on. Acute onset visual agnosia points to a stroke or brain tumor. MRI revealed no stroke or brain tumors. Do another with contrast. If he's like the other struggling artists I've known, he's also into drugs, we should... What are you looking at? Apparently a moron. One, ER routinely tests for drugs. If it was positive, we wouldn't be looking at this file. Two, who pays 12% interest on a car loan? How did you... Did you run a credit check on me? No, that would be illegal. Interestingly enough, paying someone to run it for me, though. What? It's part of my job. Your job is to diagnose patients. Which I do with the team. How am I supposed to know how best to utilize that team if I don't know everything about them? Let's say that Van Gogh turns out to have neurosyphilis, and our last vial of penicillin is in a storeroom at the end of a 20-mile hallway with a two-foot-high ceiling. You've discovered that one of us has been hiding the ability to stretch or shrink themselves? No. I would never out someone's superpowers. This, on the other hand... You crawled 20 miles? My name's in the Guinness Book. I'll bet that really impresses the babes. I didn't do it to get the babe. No, that would cheapen the purity of your achievement. Sorry to interrupt, but we have a patient with a probable brain tumor. Who needs an MRI with contrast? We've established that. What do you got on Taub? I got nothing on Taub. Could also be environmental. We should check his studio for toxins, mold, fungus. Taub's wife, on the other hand. House. That's enough. That's right. This is no time for gossip. The patient desperately needs our help. Check his head and his house. Can't Lucas? Nope. It's very busy. If there is a tumor, this test will show us. Is that stuff dangerous? This is just the contrast material. There is a small risk of an anaphylactic reaction. I can stop breathing? Don't worry. We're prepared to deal with whatever happens. You know, I did some drawings this morning, and they seem fine. So maybe it was just a reaction to something I ate. How many people you know have reactions like that to something they ate for breakfast? But if I'm getting better. You'll continue to get better. If you're not, we need to know why not so we can start treatment immediately. Baby, let them do the test. Can lead poisoning cause visual agnosia? Not without lead showing up in the blood work. Nothing in the medicine cabinet except some harmless toiletries. No signs of mold or fungus anywhere either. You think House really got something on your wife? No, not that I care if he did. Wait, your wife's doing the doorman in your bed, and they're sweating all over the sheets that you paid for, and... My wife's not doing the doorman. How do you know? We don't have a doorman. And I just do, okay? Drop it. In college, my friends and I came up with an inverse square law. Sounds like a real fun group. 
The girls who you think are the most inhibited, straight arrows, they're the ones you hook up with. Are you saying my wife's a slut? I'm saying if my wife was a slut, I'd want to know. His place was clean. So is his head. Even with contrast, no masses, no lesions. Neurological symptom with no apparent neurological cause. Time course means we can rule out cancer and MS. Just leads toxins or drugs. You called 13 a moron for thinking it was drugs. Yeah, when she said it, she had other options. I really just wanted to segue into her stupid loan and your- A cavernous angioma in the brain could leak. Once the blood gets reabsorbed, pressure goes down, symptom goes away. He'll never consent to petrosal vein sampling. Really? He was nervous about an injection of contrast. Is his girlfriend hot? Mm, I'm not talking fever here. I mean, is she all curvy and perky? Very. And if he dies, it's good news for all of that us. That explains but... why all his paintings suck. And what's wrong with him? Where are you going? Tell him he may have a massive brain tumor. But he doesn't. I know. I'm not a moron. It's drugs. You seem to have a massive brain tumor. Who are you? He's Dr. House. He's pleased to meet you. We found no trace on any of your imaging, so we need to cut your head open. It's risky, but it's the only way to save your life. No. Wrong answer. I'm not allowed to say no? You're not allowed to not be terrified. There's only two good reasons not to be terrified in a hospital. You're delusional, but then you're not afraid of contrast material either, or you know you're fine. Since we haven't told you you're fine, you obviously have information that we don't have. What drugs are you on? His drug tests were clean. Drug tests only test for drugs they made tests for. What are you talking about? Hottie, thanks to these great artists, selling art to the rich and tasteful. She's stupid enough to be fooled by the canvases. The bank accounts don't lie. He needed money. There's not many jobs you can do that don't require time, training, and intelligence. And I know you're not a news anchor or a supermodel, because those jobs seldom cause agnosia. He's a guinea pig. The company's paying him to test their untested drugs. Hottie, go for pee or coffee. See, either way, I don't think you should waste any time on denials. The clinical trials were supposed to be safe. The drugs are about to be approved by the FDA. Drugs? How many trials are you on? Three. Admirable. Not many idiots have that much ambition. You've been symptom-free since your admission, so whatever you took has probably cleared your system now. You'll be fine. Keep him overnight just to make sure and get the names of all the trials he's been in. You gonna tell Heather? Couldn't, even if I cared enough to want to. Not bad. You almost made it the whole day. What'd you find out? The point is to see how everyone reacts. I'm gonna go get the rest of the gang. Got the crap house. Your wife has a separate bank account, in her name only. She's been making weekly cash deposits for about a year now. No withdrawals, yet. That's it? A bank account? A secret bank account. What makes you think it's a secret? Because if it wasn't, you'd call it the bank account. Always forget to use the right article when lying. It's not secret. We're refurnishing. We set the budget, set up an account. I just couldn't make it to the bank the day we opened it. You're spending almost $100,000 on furniture. Yes. What happened? I don't know. It's fine, then all of a sudden you start seizing. You said you told him he was better. What's happening? What's wrong with him? She is hot. 